What is going on everybody? Jordan here at Revolve Gaming. How are y'all doing today? Hopefully you're enjoying some of this walkthrough playthrough. A little bit of both. Um, don't know everything in the game but I know some stuff and I do some research on it so I am trying to collect a lot of the stuff that you know the average person would miss. And yeah we're just laid back, we're chill, we're having fun. And we're going through the catacombs at the moment, so. Okay, so we just beat the last boss. Now, honestly, I have no idea where to go. I could have researched it, but uh, that would mean being prepared for this video. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, yeah, it's all good though. Let's kill these guys. We'll go heal. Um, I guess I could warp. Let's warp to another. Not sure which one would bring me to a different place in here. Mm. I did get a couple more twinkling titanites. I could strengthen this thing one more. You know what? Screw it. Let's do it. Um, like to get back above. idea how I'm going to do that though, so let's try and warp. Warp on out of here. I don't know where this takes me. Let's try it out. Dark moon tomb. Not where I wanted to go. Sunlight altar. Where does this take me? The undead parish. Uh, Catacomb. I think it's going to take me that one that was just that. That's my guess. Yep. Okay. So, I mean, I think I got everything out of here, but there is a couple of blue souls I'd like to get. Let's just run on past here. Keep on running. I guess that's the only way I can go. I forgot. Um, the only way to get out of here is to Homeward Bone. So. Kill those guys. Smackety smack smack. You get back up there. I wonder if a bow will knock him down. Probably not, but we'll try. Right in the tush. Nope. Uh, 
Dude. Okay, so I can run back this way. Perfect. Okay. Take this guy out. Whack him. Secrets. Oh. Let us swap the old weapon here. Let's bring up our Black Knight Sword Four. And let's whoop this guy's butt. Oh. Or <coughs> the other issue is getting our butt whooped. Got a little cocky on that one. Got a little cocky. Two catacombs. This way. <clears throat> Just keep a running. Run up. No point finding them. Here, both of those guys jump down. Now is where? Oh, he's gone. No. Can't be gone. Oh, he's just down there. I'm gonna run the hell out of here for a second. Okay, and we're gonna have to do that one more time. We'll get our souls back, but he's at least down there, and we'll just take him out. Out those other dweebs first. Okay. 
shouldn't be super hard this time. Be a little dangerous. We use one of our flasks. Let me hit that dude. <coughs> now this night should be pretty easy once we get to him. Realistically, I could lure him. Which I'm gonna do. Oh, he's already after me. Ain't that hard when we two hand him. Okay. Now we can go through that area again. Let's go back up. Uh, not the shot. Be a good idea, but whatever. Just a little bit of health. Fall down here, see where this takes us. Oh, just the other side. Okay. Should have known that part. Red and white round shield. Probably no good. Check it out. It is like I thought, garbage. It might have some properties that I don't know about, but a little bit of damage there. Run this way. Climb back up. We want to get that other soul that's on the other side. So, uh, I'm trying to think of. So, if I fall down here, it's way over that direction. Okay. So. Uh, keep in mind that right now, if I were to go left all the way down there, it would be there. Try and keep the same direction if I can. Keep track of where I need to go. So it would be down this way. Around here would be the drop, I guess. Okay, let's go. Let's 
Get out of here. Damn, let's get to go here for a second. Just for a minute. Can't see that far down. Is there a ledge there I can drop to? Where is this blue? There's one there. Of course, there's another skelly. Trying to see if I can. So there's that one. There's the two right there. So essentially. So where that shield is. Just in front of it. Alright, we're gonna try it. Let's see if we don't die. Shields right here. I feel like it should be right there. Um, let's unequip everything. Make us a little bit lighter. Uh, the flesh and bones. Heal up once. And pray we don't die. Oh yeah, we're good. Alright, so, and then the other one is right here. Don't fall off. We got priest hat, holy robe, traveling gloves, holy trousers, and a mace. Meh. Really was not worth it. But, we are trying to collect everything that we can see. Probably gonna be pretty heavy. I guess we wanna go all the way back. So we'll take a quick rest. Oh, that's slow. We're in the wrong way. Better safe than sorry. This way I can also do level up real quick. I'm going to full strength in this build. So let's go 34. Actually, no, we're gonna do one more dexterity. And then we're gonna go all strength we hit 40. Yeah, I know they're all back, but whatever. They're not that hard.
the ladder. I feel like I can. I can't open that. Hmm. Okay. I guess I could just warp right back out of here. I think I missed anything. That's pretty pretty thorough with this, so I think I feel good about leaving. Damn guy almost knocked me off. I mean I guess I could. run right through right now. Down there, I don't need to go there. Let's go back. There's a bonfire up here, I believe. Sitting there is gone. This giant snake is still there. Crow is up there. <clears throat> they all left.
you won't get 20 out of that thing though. What are you looking on? Yeah, don't ever uh, go to a dealership. They will, because like, they'll turn around and they'll sell it for 21. That's what he said, but he's going to sell it for 21. And they're going to make $5,000 off of you. Trust me, I worked in the industry for a little bit. Do not sell it uh, to a dealership unless you have like an old car you're just trying to get rid of and trade up. It's the only time it really helps you. people do a speed run when they do a speed run they come down here real quick and they go and get the special sword it makes life a lot easier at the beginning of the game so and we're out of the coffin Here in the Tomb of Giants. Just a quick run over here. Here's a new covenant. Talk to this guy. Pray to the sarcophagus grave lord. Enter covenant. He will give you the sword that he's holding in his hand. The Grave Lord Sword. Miracle Grave Lord Sword Dance. Let us offer Eye of Death. You need at least one to be able to come down here. And uh, I don't know if this does anything, but we will offer him one. So, Covenant has been deepened. And yeah, that's it from right here. Go back up. As you can see though, this weapon is quite strong. For beginners, a uh, weapon that you can get easily, 265. So, and it does look pretty sick. Like, look at that. So, we'll hop back in our coffin, go back up. And then we'll be transported back. for the pinwheel boss that I needed to check out. So we're going to go back down there and then we're going to leave, enter Firelink and end the episode. So let's go do that real quick. I guess I don't really want to equip this for right now. We're going to use the Divine Club. I guess I gotta kill some people. Nah, this is not the way we go. It would be... Okay, so... It's back this way. Go up here. I'm 
all turned around. Can't remember where to go. It's in here. So we go left, go down. Yeah, it's probably here to go down here, so jump down here. Kill that guy, kill him. Again, run through here. Keep running. Keep on running. Get your butt through here. I did not see that there was a little ladder here that we can climb up. Now this ladder. Get it. I'm running. There's an item over here that I want to get. This was by far the easiest boss in the game so far, relative to your level and skill. But he was still cool looking. So. Going this way this time, we're gonna go up here. This is a shortcut. Okay. And then up here. Not up here. Proud night. Now, I don't know where this leads us. Yeah, they just inter intertwined. Oh, okay, just leads us back here. And we can run back to the bonfire, use some of our souls that we just acquired. I uh, have a bunch that I haven't used, I think. And more buddy here to Firelink and do <coughs> the next level. So we will be ending the episode here pretty quick once I get this level up. <coughs> A very small amount for that one. <coughs> We 
we're gonna warp out of here to Farlink. And that will be it for this episode. Next episode, we're gonna go do a few things that I have planned, so. We shall rest. Thanks for watching everybody, we will see you next time and as always, hope your day is awesome.